over 90% of the mental life is subconscious which means we are only using 10% consciously if we are not using the remaining 90% to our benefit it means that we are actually narrowing our potential the subconscious mind works 24/7 like breathing digestion circulation system all these things works non stop why how this is working because subconscious mind is having a secret tie up with the infinite wisdom the boundless power the subconscious mind will give you intuitions inspirations aspirations for example uh, have you seen this movie vetayadu vilayadu in that movie kamala hasan breaks in the door of jyotika's room and he comes inside and save her from the suicide the next day morning jyotika asks him how was it possible how did you find that i was about to commit suicide and he said hunches hunches where did he get that from the subconscious mind somebody used to say that i want to do this i get a gut feeling that this will work but if you ask him give me a logical reason how this is going to work they will never know how to explain why because this is not coming consciously this is coming unconsciously we have to give respect to the things which we get the gut feeling and then we have to do it because the purpose of subconscious mind is to keep you healthy it is to make you the best in whatever you do it is the purpose is to get you whatever you wanted so our job is to just listen to what we get in the form of hunches and then we have to just do it do you know the organ responsible for conscious mind it is cerebrospinal system this cerebrospinal system will control for example the senses what you want to touch what you want to see what you want to feel what you want to think all these things you have a choice you can control this is called the conscious mind's organ the cerebrospinal system and for the subconscious mind there is an organ which is called sympathetic system and the sympathetic system's key organ is solar plexus it is not here it is exactly just above the navel it is called solar plexus and this solar plexus is called the abdominal mind or the gut feeling or the subconscious mind now let me tell you how these are actually connected how whatever you think how it is going to become a reality imagine your brain and from the brain a thick electrical wire is actually coming down and while it is coming down it is actually going to your uh, vocal systems the audio and hearing things and from there it is going down to the heart and the lungs you know the wires are getting distributed and the electrical wires are still going down the moment it reaches diaphragm you know the electrical wire will have an outer sheathing you know the plastic thing the insulation the moment it passes through the diaphragm there are only electrical wires which means the nerves are going without the outer sheathing and it is going and getting connected with the solar plexus so when you think using your thoughts when you sense something when you see something you create a vibration that vibration is transferred to the electrical wires which means your nerves and that vibration is going through the diaphragm to the solar plexus through the metallic wires so this is how whatever you think the subconscious mind takes it and manifests it for you the researchers have found that our body grows every 11 months so from the physical standpoint of you i am only 11 months old so if you have any disease if you have any problem with your body you can actually get a new body in just 11 months so what is that which is actually stopping from getting healthy getting better it is our bad thoughts the anger the anxiety the hatred all these negative emotions are actually making you to be in a bad condition
So make sure you substitute the negative thoughts with the positive thoughts. And when you are having positive thoughts, you feel happy, you are in harmony. And when you are in harmony, the energy inside you actually flows smoothly. Make sure you are healthy always. Please understand it is very normal to be healthy. It is abnormal to be unhealthy. So please comment in the comment box whatever you have learned so that I know that whatever I am making this video for is having some benefit from you. Sharing is caring. Bye.